Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is vlogist uh, number. <laughs> Today is um, the 15th of August. We just, me and Jesse just got home. We've been running around all day. I had some errands to run today. Devin's at work, so he borrowed my mom's car to take to work. So I could keep our car, do errands, and we went to my nephew's little birthday party. It was a little one, and um, it was fun. So we just got back from there. Whew, I'm tired. But I wanted to hop on real fast because I haven't made a video in a couple days. And I wanted to uh, show you guys what I've been working on. I should be working on my lovey. <laughs> I keep thinking, oh, well, I'm going to sit down and work on that lovey. And then I pick this project up and I keep working on it and I forget to pick up the lovey. This is my scrap granny blanket that I'm making with all my scrap balls. So I showed it to you when it was a little bit smaller. I can, I'm not going to be able to show it. Let me get my tripod. Alright, I got my tripod. <laughs> uh, I was going to try to just hold the camera. But I need two hands. But anyways, I keep picking it up. And I, I it's just fun. It's just fun to mindlessly make granny uh, stitches over and over again. And pick random balls to uh, to work into it. Where's that? Okay. So, it, I made it pretty long. <laughs> I'm using a J-hook. I think it's a J-hook. Let me look. It is J, yeah. Six millimeter. And I'm just using worsted weight scraps. It's mostly Red Heart, but there are a few other brands randomly in there. I chained it a um, hundred and I think 41 stitches, you know, chains. And uh, then went back. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I think that's what I did. So yeah, there it is so far. It's going to be big, but I wanted it a big, you know, blanket to put on the couch or whatever. So right now I'm using this frosty green color. This ball is actually bigger. And I'm down to my bigger scrap balls. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to work some of it and then cut it. <laughs> add another ball and just kind of make my own scraps. Just so there's not big chunks of one color. Because I've got my scrap tote right here. Ooh. And I used up most of the little balls already. So these are mostly big balls. They're, they're, they average like that big. Big old hair on there. <laughs> um, I don't know, like a third of a skein. But there are some in here that are much larger. Like that one. And that's a cake yarn. And um, there's some down there that's like half skeins. So those I don't want big huge chunks of certain colors. So I'm just going to kind of make my own scraps. Until I come up with more scraps. But my point is I'm trying to empty out this bucket. Because, um... I've had a lot of these scrap yarns in here forever, and uh, usually pro projects that I make need more yarn than I think a scrap will handle, except for like little applique pieces. So I'm just trying to use this up and uh, clear out this tote so I can either get rid of it or store something else in it. And um, yeah, because I got a lot of yarn and I need to work through it. <laughs> That's my goal. So getting rid of scraps. And I'm going to leave all my tails. I triple knot them, and I'm going to leave them just hanging because I think it'll add to the scrappiness of the blanket. I think it'd be cute and scrappy looking. <laughs> but yeah, so I keep picking it up. I should work on my lovey. I haven't worked on it at all. But that's okay. And then this coming week, over here, I got all my fabric out of my stash. It's all, these are big pieces. They've all been washed and folded. Some of them's already been cut, but I need to start cutting those. And I'm going to try to make as many bags as I can out of that. And uh, before I go back and purchase some more. Cause I'm just trying to go through my craft stuff and use up stuff that's been sitting around. But uh, I should be able, to be able to make a ton of bags out of this right here because it's a lot of fabric. And I think most of them will be drawstring bags just because I can make them quicker. And I'm wanting to try to use up that fabric so that I can buy some new cute prints. And um, yeah, so we'll see. I'll probably, uh, I might start cutting some of that tomorrow because Devin has to work tomorrow also. So I'll be home and uh, just cut it up and start getting ready to make some bags. <laughs> But yeah, so that's what I'm up to today, craft-wise. I'm tired. I've been running around all day. Just got home, and in a couple hours, i got to leave again. Because uh, Devin's going to go to my mom's after work to drop off her car. And I'm going to go up there and pick him up. And then we're going to head either here to eat dinner, or we might go over to his dad's house. Because they're doing, like, a uh, fire pit thing tonight. But Devin has work tomorrow, so I don't know if he will want to go. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> but I will try to make another video tomorrow. Maybe uh, something more... Than just showing my blanket <laughs> and uh if not for sure in a couple of days but yeah so i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys